Hello friends, welcome to another C++ interview question and the question is how to assign any object like uh, it could be in base class object or derived class object or any object which is not primitive data type okay like character and teaser and all that so how would you do that the, here is an example so let's say there is a base class and we have a variable integer variable so this is the data member and we have these two constructors and this is the key to do that okay so the answer to this is you need to define operator integer okay in your class in order to allow the conversion from class to integer okay so this is the example here you are creating this base object which is b and you are assigning 100 to that so this assignment is happening here okay this is little bit new if you don't know don't be, uh, get confused here i'm not doing anything special here it is just var is equal to var okay so instead of writing in this bracket there is this new syntax this is called initializer list i will make video on this later so you have initialized it now you want to assign object which is of base class into integer okay so this is integer and you are assigning some object which is a base class so simply if it is not there let's say this is not there then it won't compile so, no first i will show you the compile case so this this will compile just because of this only okay so what will we'll do here we'll call this function and we'll return the value what was set by 100 okay so 100 will come here and we will print that so let's go and check the so let's go and run the code number two and this let's see this is 100 so we are printing temp here and it is coming 100 let's say you are giving some value let's say some value okay then it should print that we'll compile and it is printing that value so as you can see we are getting this this value in temp and this is the way to do that and if it is not there let's say this is not there and you will compile it will show you error that you cannot convert base to integer in initialization okay so in order to achieve this you need this operator int to be overloaded here okay and notice this guys you are not returning anything like integer or something here you have not given any return type and why you have not given because it is pretty sure that if you are assigning to integer you will be returning integer only okay so that's why you are not writing any integer here okay so that's it i'm done here thanks for watching and check out my other videos so that you will get good set of questions to prepare your c plus interview okay bye bye